Hello friends, Ashley Ruziar here. I am at Baltimore Comic Con 2023. I brought my Shauna for Kids books. I brought my comic books. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Baltimore Comic Con is the premier Comic Con on the East Coast. If you love comic book creators, the top talent from the industry from all over the world converge here for three days. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I even brought some of my own comic books to get signed. Hope you check out this video. One awesome thing about Baltimore Comic Con this year is that kids can get their own little souvenir stamp sheet and it features stamps from all the creators in the Kid Love Comics section this year. And check this out, Seamorph stamp. So cool. So I'm on my way to meet one of my favorite pro wrestlers, AEW's Danhausen. I'm really excited. I'm a big fan of his, and I have a feeling this is gonna be pretty cool. Thank you. I want to give you my books. Oh, cool. Yeah. This is my own kids' book. Oh, yeah. So I love it. Cool. Turn the book to television first. That's awesome. Thank you. Appreciate everything you guys next year. Your videos really cheered me up during the pandemic. Thank you so much. I really to my spirit. I really want to talk to you. I really appreciate it. My brother and I are both here. Thank you for being here. Tell him I said thank you too. I will. I will. Thanks, man. That's a whole long story. So, my brother ordered a cameo for you. Yeah. For my birthday. Was it good? You nailed my memes. Our names are perfect. This is it? No, Arsene. No. Oh, right there, right Arsene, there. Yeah. Arsene, yeah. Arsene, so yeah. I was very yeah. impressed. Like, yeah, this guy got our name down. <laughs> One of the things that I love most about Baltimore Comic Con is how many amazing comic book creators are here every year. You get to talk to them, get your comic sign. It's a lot of fun, especially if you're a big comic book fan like I am. Now, I am a comic book fan since I was a kid, and I'm also a comic creator, so this year I brought some of the comics that I worked on to get signed by the creators I worked on the books with at Marvel. Uh, I got to meet John Bogdanoff for the first time, fantastic Superman artist. I worked on an issue of Hulk with him. It was a really fun experience. Cool guy, super nice. Check it out. Hello. Good afternoon. I was the colorist on this issue of Hulk. Oh, you were? So it was a total honor to get to work with you. I had so much fun. I loved the coloring on that episode. Thank you, yeah. This was so much fun. Like the blues and aquas I did with this. Yes. It was a blast for me. I love your stuff, Superman. So when I found out you were doing this issue, I was like, yeah. Oh, I'd always want to do that. So if you don't mind signing my personal copy, I'm sure. I would love to do that. I would love to do that. What's your name? Marcia. Marcia. Of course. 
We'll see you yeah, next the, year. The, yes. whole, the whole mix. For sure. Of, All right, man. Yeah. Everything in the whole palette, okay. the whole story, works with his green as if to emphasize his green. Exactly. And I That's just, color theory. I theory. just love the use of color theory. Yeah. Thank you. You know, usually with the Hulk, it's like, you might get like a token purple, you get home. But this, everything works so well that it, 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 uh, it feels distinctly in the whole thing. Thank you. Really I'll, be, I'll be frank with you, I was personally green at the time too, so. Really? That was like my second year as a colorist, so. It was, it was pretty fun to get well, to work with artists like you. The other thing I, the other thing I, the other thing I really like about it is that it's, Nicely and sensitively modeled, without competing with the black box. You know, well, many colorists they just yeah. they use the they use the artwork as a starting point to just make a painting, and uh, and often at odds with the artwork. And you strike a perfect balance. Here. Thank you kindly for your work. So I really, really, really appreciate this. One of my favorite coloring jobs actually Thank you. of my whole career. Thank you so much. One of my favorite books of color. Yeah, it was fun. I wish they asked me back to do some more. Wow. Okay, where should I sign it? Oh, you, know, you didn't need a cover. Just, no. What, what are you coming with? Do you want to cover? I kind of want to sign this plan. Yeah. Okay, sure. Because when I flipped onto this, I was like, oh wow, that's so much better than what I did. <laughs> okay. I appreciate it. I mean, look at the... I actually have a children book off of me. I rarely color. I color maybe one book a year now, but I mostly like children's books. I do children's books more ancient versions of stuff. I knew you were too good to say that. You really, you know how to use blue so well. And even blue against blue, and it just, it just sings. It just pops. I appreciate it. Wow. I'm really pleased to be here. Pleased to be here as well, man, for sure. Thank you, sir. Let me share my favorite page. With this one. This one's my favorite page. I mean, to be oh, yeah. fair, you know what? Uh, to be fair, he took off. <laughs> yes. The way the way you pop this into the foreground, you see a little bit of blue, a little bit of blue fading into the. <laughs> this suggests a little bounce light in the shadow. Yep. Yep. That was a lot of fun looking. So you know what good. you're doing, and whenever you look at the person who knows what they're doing, it takes your colors to a whole new level. It's just classic. It's just so good. See, man, I'm going with the paper. I appreciate it. It's rich. never done that. That was fun. Yeah, that's, that's one of my favorites. Yeah, I'm going to move it over to one No, 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 no. In this case, it's really okay. In this case, it's really okay. You hit the highlights in your face, but who cares? I was a little effects heavy back then. Yeah, the, yeah, I know. Because nobody was doing it back then, so. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Northern Virginia, so not too far. Okay, I grew up in Richmond. So. Oh, there you go. It was nice meeting you, sir. Nice meeting you, sir. Perfect.
There's me. <laughs> Living at a high rate of speed. <laughs> That's my shield, my armor. That's awesome. That gal right there, cat. She was hell on wheels with this orange boy. For all my friends from the Seattle Knights. Oh yeah? <laughs> this guy is the director. His name is Damian Willick. Dave McCollum. That's wild. Uh, Lee Kessler, who's really about half the size of this guy. But but he plays a villain, a, a really cool villain. Well, it was an honor to work on these books with you, myself. Perfect. That is a wrap for Baltimore Comic-Con 2023. We'll see you next year.